starting my live stream right now. Just gonna wait a couple of minutes, or a couple of seconds, until uh, people start showing up. Welcome to my live stream. How is everyone doing today? It's actually very toasty in this one room I'm recording. <laughs> so I'm gonna try not to sweat so much while I uh, do this stream. Oh, cool. We got uh, the first question here. Uh, what is a production designer? Uh, well, a production designer, they're responsible for creating the visual of the uh, show or any kind of like entertainment like, uh, you know, games, uh, movies, TV series, etc. Uh, we work closely with the director and producer to create the style. Um, that it also involves like creating the character design, the props, and uh, trying to set up the tone for the series. Favorite part of the production? My favorite parts of the uh, production, oh gosh, I really enjoy designing the uh, bad guys. Uh, for example, Bluster, he is one of the uh, main villains of uh, Care Bears Unlock the Magic. Um, I really enjoyed playing with uh, different expressions, different poses for him. He's a very uh, crazy villain. I like to make him look very, he's, he's, he's a dummy. I love him. So I hope you guys like him too. <laughs> I went to Ringling College of Art and Design. I got a, a BFA in illustration in uh, 2013, so that's, uh, that's quite a long time ago. I have been working on the Care Bears for, oh gosh, actually ever since I, after I graduated college, which was 2013, so. If I can math here, <laughs> quite a few years. <laughs> Ooh, this is a great question. My favorite Care Bear. Uh, I really love Funshine Bear because he is very relatable. Um, we actually, I like to say uh, bro and dude a lot, and uh, yeah, Funshine, he says all of that too. Um, he's a very active, funny bear. Uh, I, we both enjoy eating burritos and pizza. <laughs> uh, my favorite shows right now. I've been binge watching or re watching uh, Bob's Riggers. I really like to watch uh, The Office on repeat. Um, Brooklyn Nine-Nine is one of my favorite shows. And uh, of course I do like to watch a lot of anime. Right now, Boku no Hero. <sighs> what am I influenced by? Um, this is a good question. Uh, I am influenced by a lot of things, actually. Um, I like uh, to do a lot of people watching, um, a lot of uh, you know researching on uh, animals uh, and their behaviors in real life. Like I get my influence from uh, mostly my dog, just like the way he acts. Um, uh, I do enjoy uh, a lot of you know memes, so that's where I get a lot of my influences. <laughs> of course. <laughs> uh, so far, I think at the top of my head, I really like the uh, Pikachu meme. Uh, I have two, uh, three other, two other favorite memes actually. Uh, is this a pigeon meme? 
And then the last one is uh, the squinting lady meme. What is my favorite episode? It is currently out on Boomerang. Uh, my favorite episode is episode 9 where Fun Shine Bear accidentally breaks a uh, cheer bear's necklace. So <laughs> he had to uh, figure out how to fix it and he had to figure out like you know where to hide it. Um, and I think that was uh, that episode reminded me of when I was young. I would break a lot of stuff. Um, and I would, uh, you know, do my best to hide them from my parents and uh, try not to get in trouble. But in the end, I kind of felt guilty. So I would just like, you know, come out clean. Hey, be like, oh, mom, I'm sorry, I broke your uh, uh, spatula or something. <laughs> I broke your uh, cooking timer, kitchen timer. Yeah. Dibble, how did she come to be? Uh, she was created along with the Wiffles. Um, since she is uh, the youngest of uh, the Wiffle group, I kind of imagined her to be very innocent, childlike, and very naive. Um, very cute, so I designed her with uh, the idea that she uh, looks like, or behaves like a child. So I gave her big eyes uh, and uh, made her look uh, super cute, <laughs> very cute. Um, initially she was uh, an orange colored uh, whiffle, but then I decided to go with uh, the strawberry pink color to help her stand out in the uh, Kibber lineup. Uh, yeah, I think that's how she came to be. <laughs> uh, I like, I use the uh, Cintiq, the Wacom Cintiq, which is what I am currently working on right now. Um, and uh, the programs that I use for, uh, for work, uh, to create the characters, I use Photoshop, and that's the, my main program. But when I'm at home, I use my uh, iPad Pro, and uh, the program I use on that is the uh, Procreate. Uh, you guys can watch the Care Bears Unlock the Magic on Boomerang. If you sign up for... If you sign up on Boomerang, uh, you get one week of uh, free trial. Make sure you're old enough or make sure your parents are there to help you sign up. That is a very good question. What do I do when I get art blocks? Uh, I usually take a break. I go work out. I hang out with my friends and uh, I just play with my dog a lot until uh, an idea comes into mind. Uh, what are some of the challenges I faced as a production designer? That is, this is a very good question. Um, it's uh, the challenge I faced as a production designer. I had to figure out how to work with uh, different time zones that my uh, the director and the producers are in. Um, 
a lot of uh, back and forth uh, emails and just like waiting for uh, them to respond and I think that's like the most difficult but you know in the end it, it all works out. <laughs> Yes, Dibble, you are a very cute wiffle. And yes, I do like cake. <laughs> Coffee flavor cake. <laughs> I know, Dibble, Grumpy is your favorite bear. Thank you so much everyone for joining my live stream. I hope you all enjoyed it. Um, so if you really like seeing more of my live stream, please comment. See you next time. Bye.